what's the value of paying with zero? Like a surface area volume ratio, specifically looking at the cube. So in this case, we have our surface area is 6s squared, and our volume is s cubed, s being the length of one side of the cube. So determine the surface area volume ratio for a cube with a side length of 2, where our s is going to be 2. And so our surface area is 6s squared, s being 2, 2 squared is 4. 6 times 4 is 24. And then for our volume is going to be s cubed, so 2 cubed is going to give me 8. So my surface area volume ratio is going to be 24 over 8, which is 3. Pause the video and see if you can do this problem on your own. Determine surface area volume ratio for a cube with a side length of 4. So s is equal to 4. My surface area is 6s squared, s being 4. So 4 squared is 16. So 6 times 16 is going to give us 96. My volume is going to be s4 cubed. So 4 cubed is going to give me 64. So 96 divided by 64 is 1.5. Um, so in this case, which one is more efficient? You want the one with the largest surface area volume ratio. So that would be the first example we did. Hope this helped. Remember, 8-5 pain was just success by all.